So what's the difference between competitive player and casuals? The simple answer is math. But before we talk about numbers, let's lay out the variables first. Specifically, what's the difference between additive and multiplicative buffs? Yeah, it's hard to say. If you try to research this, it all sounds like magic, but it's really pretty simple. Additive damage buffs are shown by a plus symbol before the number on the tooltip. It's just adding a raw bonus. Additive damage buffs will often have diminishing returns. However, I can't find hard proof of this for Diablo 4 yet. So we'll just have to wait for updates later on. Diminishing returns just means we'll get less benefits when we cross certain thresholds. Skills and gear have variations of additive and multiplicative buffs. Multiplicative buffs will increase your damage output by a lot. These are shown by the multiplication sign before the number in the tooltip. This buff type is one of the tricks to crafting builds that do really big damage. Let's use upheaval as an example with a weapon that deals 100 damage. At level 1, upheaval deals 70% damage, and 70% of 100 puts our base damage from upheaval to 70. We're looking at this in a bubble, guys. Now let's say I have three items that give a plus 50% additive damage to the attack. So that's 70 times 2.5 equals 175 damage from the one attack compared to three items that increase damage multiplicatively by 50%. 70 times da da da, 3.375 equals 236 damage from the same attack. So yes, multiplying gives us bigger numbers, we get that. But what does it all really mean? And we're gonna start off with the weapon. Typically you wanna use a weapon that has the most raw damage. Other stats aren't usually as important, but there are always exceptions to a rule, so use your best judgment. Critical hit chance is an additive bonus that has a cap of 100%. As far as I know, we haven't seen any diminishing returns quite yet. Increasing this will increase your average damage output. Basically, you'll see yellow numbers more often. Crit hit damage, on the other hand, is multiplicative and will increase your yellow damage numbers tremendously. When theory crafting builds, our goal is consistency. So going with crit hit chance initially is usually the safe bet, but once you have over 50%, you can start to focus on crit hit damage more. And let's talk about lucky hit and overpower in this next video. 